Hello! This shall be my complete TV collection, including uh, TV shows, including uh, DVD and Blu-ray, and I don't think I own any 4K TV shows, but if I do, it'll be shown off in this video. This will include everything TV I own, from uh, A all the way to Z, so, uh, because I have them all alphabetized. This shall be as of January 29th, 2022. So anyway, without further ado, shall we begin? So I keep half of, well, more than half of my TV shows in this little bookcase right here. That's the one with all the figures on top of. So first we'll uh, show the Stranger Things thing off first. I, I think that's pretty cool. I got it on Black Friday. It's blurry, but it is in the VHS uh, format. And I think it's just so cool. It was only uh, seven bucks, so I couldn't go wrong with that. So now we'll actually go through the uh, TV shows. Let me just get situated. Alrighty, and I'll tell you which ones I have seen and which ones I haven't. So, I've seen this, 24, Season 1, Season 2, Season 3, Season 4, Season 5, if it wants to go back in. It's easier said than done, there we go. Season 6. The uh, uh, movie, the two-hour special event, 24 Redemption. Season 7. Season 7 on Blu-ray. I found it for 5 bucks, so I decided to upgrade it. And then, if we come backwards a little bit, the complete eighth and final season. I've seen half of this one. I still haven't watched the rest, so I still gotta watch it. And then the uh, TV miniseries, which was 24 Live Another Day. Haven't watched it yet. Then we got Alias. I've only seen the first episode, but it's Jennifer Gardner and Victor uh, Garber in it, so why not? So that's the first season. Season two. Haven't watched it. I have watched this. The American Horror Story. Sorry, not the just American Horror Story. First season. Second season. And I've watched all the new seasons on either Netflix or Hulu. Then we got Ash vs. Evil Dead. The first season. Watched it. Great. I've watched the first two episodes of Ballers. It's okay so far. I like Dwayne Johnson, so that's the only reason why I decided to pick up the show. Big Bang Theory. I've seen seasons one through four. So we got the first season. Season two. Season three. Season four. Five. Six. And the 10th, because it was on sale on Blu-ray for like $10, so I decided to pick it up. So if we come over here, we got Blacklist. This is the first season. I own season two, a friend is borrowing it, and I, I've i watched all the other seasons on Netflix. It is such a great show, I highly recommend it. Once you think you know which way the story is going, you don't, I promise. And then I got Black Sales seasons one through four on um, DVD, but then uh, on Black Friday... Amazon was having a sale, so I picked it up on uh, Blu-ray, and it was only uh, $30? No, I think it was actually $25, so it was actually really dirt cheap. Then after that, we got Blind Spot, the complete first season on Blu-ray. I've seen uh, most of that. Bones, uh, the complete first season. Haven't watched it. Breaking Bad, uh, season one on DVD. I'll put it back later. Season two, three, four five and final i've only ever seen one through four i haven't seen five and six yet so i'll get to it <laughs> the cape the mini series i haven't watched it criminal mind season one season two season three i've seen all of this season four and if we come down here let me just get situated the best I can. There we go. Season 5. Season 6. Season 7. Season 8. Season 9. Season 10. I'll do an unboxing video for these. 11. And 12. So all I need is, I believe, 13, 14, and 15, then I have the complete series. I haven't seen the final season yet, but I've seen seasons 1 through 12 on uh, Netflix and Hulu and all that. And then the, um... Okay. And then the spinoff show, Criminal Minds Beyond Borders, starring Gary Sinise. 
Then we go into my CSI collection, which I do have quite a bit. So please stick with me for this. So then we got CSI, the complete first season on DVD. This is probably still the best season, but arguably season two is really good too from this series. So we got CSI, the complete second season, the complete third season, fourth. If you kept up with CSI, let me know what your favorite season was. Fifth, fifth. this had a really funny episode in it, if I remember right. Uh, see, uh, the complete sixth season, the seventh, the eighth, which was a... Uh, his final season before they decided to uh, reboot it. And then they did that movie too. Well, it wasn't really a reboot, but then we got season nine on uh, Blu-ray has Lawrence Fishburne in it. Season 10 with Lawrence Fishburne. And that was uh, season 11 is his final season. If I remember right. And then we got season 12, which brought in Ted Danson. I was actually a fan of when they brought Ted Danson and I thought he did a pretty good job with it. Season 13. Season 14, I love the look of uh, that season, I just, uh, great cover. And then the uh, complete final season before they did the movie. So, if we come over here now, let me just readjust myself a little bit. This is the first season of CSI Miami, I bought it off Amazon, it didn't come with the slip cover. Then we got the second season, then we got the third, and this is where I stopped watching it, but I did actually get season uh, four, haven't watched it yet though, and season five. And then the sixth season. Sorry about that. There we go. And the final season, which is not season seven. I want to say it's like season 10. But if you know what it is, uh, comment down in the comments below. And then we got CSI New York, the complete first season. I did actually enjoy this one. Season two. I watched all the way up to season five or six on this, I want to say. CSI season three, New York. Season 4. I'm a big Gary Sinise fan, so I like his stuff. Season 7. And they usually did crossovers, too. Then if we come down here, that's where it stops for the CSI stuff. Up there, we got Duck Dynasty Season 3, the Duck Luxe Edition. And then uh, Chris Angel Mind Freak, the complete first season. I got this off Amazon for a penny. It was a penny. I, I couldn't believe it. But let me move those two. Now, let's do this. We got Chris Angel Mind Freak, the complete second season. Then the complete third, uh, the complete third season, or the complete season three. Dead Zone, the complete first season. Defiant season one. Dexter season one. Season two. Season three. Season four. And season five. I watched the rest off of uh, Netflix. Doctor Who series nine part one. I got this on Black Friday. Haven't watched this part yet, but I have watched uh, the complete run with Michael Eccleston. I believe that's his name. Dragon Ball Z season one. Uh, Best of Duck Dynasty. Duck Dynasty season one. Season two, volume one. Now this show is great. I highly recommend this show. The follow up with Kevin Bacon. I've only seen the first season. I haven't watched season two or three yet, but it is great. Now this is another show I highly recommend if you love uh, sci-fi. This is Fringe. This is a complete first season, second, third, fourth, and the complete fifth and final season. Game of Thrones. I know it got a lot of hype, but I'm personally, I didn't really like totally get it. I watched most of it. I just, I wasn't a huge fan of it. It wasn't my go-to show at all, but that's season four, season five, season six, and season seven. Winter is here. Dun, 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 dun. And then we got uh, the Goldbergs, the complete first season. I got that for a buck, so can't go wrong with that. Grim, season one, and then season uh, five, and season six. Those were Black Friday buys. Hannibal, this is a great show. It's too bad it was canceled. Heroes, season one, season two, season three, and season four. Homeland, the complete first season. Stephen King's uh, Kingdom Hospital, the complete series. Key and Peele, seasons one and two. And Kung Fu, the complete collection. Now, if we come down here, which I really gotta move about now. Let me move that stuff. Law and Order, the complete first season of SVU. Law and Order, Trial by Jury, the complete series. Lethal Weapon, the first season, which is still the best because, boy, did that show go off the rails. Masters of Horror, season one, volume one. And I got a couple of the movies, uh, The Damned Thing. We All Scream for Ice Cream. 
And then uh, season one, uh, volume two, which has three short movies in it. Then we got NCIS, the complete first season. Complete second. Okay, I'll just leave that there for now. Season three. Season four. Season five. Season six. Season nine. And season ten. Then if we come over to that, we got Once Upon a Time, the complete first season. Once Upon a Time, the complete second season. The complete third season. Uh, the Outsider, based off the Stephen King novel. Penny Dreadful, the complete first season. The complete second season. And the final season. Then we have Prison Break, season two. And then the final break, the movie that they made in between, um, I believe, the finale. Then we got regular show, Fright Pack. Rick and Morty, season one. Season two. And season three, Pickle Rick. Then, um, give me a split second. Sorry about that. We got The River, the complete first season. Saturday Night Live, the complete first season from 1975. Then we got uh, season two. Scream Queens, this is a great show. It's too bad it was canceled. I thought it was great. Let me move that. The Shield, I haven't watched it yet, but I really like Michael Chiklis, so that's why I got it. Then we got The Simpsons, the complete first season. The complete second season. The complete third season. The complete fourth season. And then we jump over to the 11th season and the 17th season. So it's kind of all over the place. Then we got The Simpsons, Kiss and Tell, the story of their love. Simpsons, uh, uh, there we go, Treehouse of Horror, The Shinning, uh, The Simpsons Christmas 2, and then we got The Simpsons Movie, because I figured man will put it there with that, and then if we come over there, that's where the rest of my TV shows are. The first thing you're greeted with when you come in here is Quantum Leap, the complete series, Sleepy Hollow, the complete first season, the complete second season. Uh, South Park, the complete sixth season. Spartacus, the complete series. Star Trek uh, Enterprise, season one. Star Trek Picard, season one. Then we got Supernatural, season one. Season two. Season three. Season four. Season five. Season six. Season seven. Season eight. Season 9, Season 10, Season 11, Season 12, Season 13, okay, Season 14, and the complete 15th and final season. Then we got Tales from the Dark Side, the complete series. Then we got Tales from the Crypt, the complete first season. Then if we come down here, let me just move about a little bit. A couple of things. We've got, um, for some reason, three there. I'm going to have to rearrange this, but that's season three, season four, season two, which belongs over there. Then we've got season five, season six, and season seven. Then we've got Teen Wolf uh, season one, Teen Wolf season two. And then I've been watching the rest off uh, Amazon Prime. Then we got Terminator, the complete first season. Then we got Terminator, uh, the Sarah Connor Chronicle, sorry, the complete second and final season. Then we got Touch with uh, Kiefer Sutherland. And also the uh, kid from Gotham that plays Bruce Wayne, Tremors, the series. True Blood, the complete first season. The Twilight Zone, the reboot. Two and a Half Men, season one. The Vampire Diaries, season one. The Vampire Diaries, Season 3. Then we got The Walking Dead, Season 1. Season 2. Season 3. Season 4. Season 5. Season 6. Season 7. Season 8. Season 9. And of course, Season 10. And then we got uh, Fear of the Walking Dead, Seasons 1 through 3. I got this on Black Friday. Season 4. And season five. And then we got uh, Walking Dead World Beyond season one. Westworld season one. Westworld season two. Witchblade, the complete series. 
then um, the X Files, the complete first season, then the complete second season. Now I got a little bit more TV, but we're gonna have to go up there. So uh, I got this Smallville set, the complete series on Blu-ray. I bought this on Black Friday off Amazon, and I am very happy with my purchase. I did do a uh, full unboxing video of this one already, but let me just put this over here. And then we got some more TV shows over here. We got Arrow, uh, season one, season two, Flash season one, Arrow season three, Constantine, uh, that's the movie, Flash season two, Arrow season four, uh, season one of Supergirl, season one of Legends, season two of Supergirl, season two of uh, Legends, season four, uh, three of Flash, Arrow, I'm not going to name all the seasons, I'm just going to name the show Supergirl, Legends, Flash, Arrow, Flash, Supergirl, Arrow, Legends, Batwoman, Supergirl, The Flash, Arrow, Legends, Stargirl, Batwoman, Superman and Lois, The Flash, Black Lightning, Titans, Pennywise, Batman the Complete Animated Series, Batman Beyond the Complete Series, Arrow Season 1 and Flash Season 1 on DVD, Gotham Season 1 on DVD, Season 2 on DVD, Season 3 on DVD, then Season 4 on Blu-ray. Season 4 is my favorite season. Then if we come down here, we got Gotham the Complete 5th uh, the fifth and Final Season on Blu-ray. Then I got Superman and Lois the Complete, uh, the complete First Season. The Flash, the complete uh, series. Then if we come over here, we got Batman on DVD, the animated series, Volume 1, Volume 2, Volume 3, and Volume 4. Then uh, for Superman, the animated series, we got Volume 1, Volume 2, Volume 3, Justice League, the animated series, Volume uh, Season 1 and 2, Justice League uh, Season uh, 2. Then if we uh, just move the Joker right here, we've got The Batman, which is a great animated TV show. I got Seasons 1 through 5 of that. Teen Titans, the complete first season. Then uh, Beware the Batman, uh, pretty much the complete first season. Then Justice League Action, pretty much the complete first season. Then, if we come over here, I'm um, going fast through this because it's already been covered in my other videos. Uh, we got... um. Batman, uh, the animated, uh, the, uh, 66 series, Krypton, Lucifer, and Birds of Prey. And then if we come up here, the complete series on DVD of Smallville. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and a subscribe so I know to keep making more of these. Uh, this video was filmed over the course of two days, that's why I am wearing a different shirt. But anyway, if you have any video requests, please leave them down in the comments below. I'll do my best to reply. I got a couple more videos set up. Uh, it's been about a week since I made any new videos, but I am back at it now again. But anyway, thanks for watching as always, and I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye!